Have you thought about what the Lord has done for you? Because we like to compare any, anyway. It can't be just something you like. It's got to be something you like over what somebody else likes. That, that's how we messed up in this society. I can't just be happy with what I'm doing. I, 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 I gotta, my happiness is based on what somebody else is doing. We live in a monkey see, monkey do world. All my preacher friends even drive, they drive in European cars. Amen. BMWs, Mercedes, all them. So one of my preacher friends asked me, Bird, when you going to come up? I said, come up to what? Man, you need to get your Benz. No, I'm a Cadillac man. I was born a Cadillac man. And guess what? They're going to drive me to the, to the cemetery in a Cadillac. Zion, when y'all bury me now, don't you have no Lincolns pulling in front of this church. I'm going to get up. Find me a Cadillac somewhere. Why? Because that's what I like. I wish I had somebody in the house. You don't have to buy what everybody else has. That's what I like. And the problem with us, we have lost sight of the value on what God has for us because we're too busy trying to compare it with what somebody else has. But how many of you know that what God has for me, it is for me? Do you? Let me do me. And how do I do me? I continue to give God glory, not for what he's given to somebody else, but I give him glory for what he's given just for me.